pitch of the game on its way. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 1. Hey, he's been able to pound that zone all night, working that outer half of the plate. That's why he's having so much success. Grounded back up the middle. Albies picks it up. And there's one oh. down now. So the Red Sox lineup turns over and to the plate, Kike Hernandez. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. Just able to get a piece of that for strike one. Offensive game plan needs to change right here. They need to get a little bit more aggressive. It's too late to try and work counts. A ball and a strike. Right guy, right spot. This is one of the better hitters in their lineup. Just the guy they want to see coming up now to get this inning going. Fouled away. Bases are empty, one man out. A swing and a miss for route number two, and a ball he had no chance of making contact with. And now, Kyle Schwarber, 0 for 2 for him to this point. Tried to golf at it, but he missed strike one. In today's game, with velocity and exploding breaking stuff, you have to find a way to control the no strike ball. zone as a unit. They haven't been able to do that today, swinging at way too many pitches outside the zone. And right into the shift, but a foul ball, and the count holds it 0-2. He's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. Seventh inning ready to roll, and striding forward the designated hitter, Orlando Garcia, line towards center field, and a base hit, so early trouble to lead off the inning. Standing in now, Dansby Swanson, as he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. A hit in two tries for him so far. And he fouls this one off. Here's the 0-2. High in the air down the right field line. And that will end up a foul ball. And it's fouled away. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Verdugo waits on it. One down. So the lineup flips over and digging in. Eddie Rosario. No hits in three tries. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. There's one. He's out. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. For the traditional seventh inning stretch. Last half of the seventh here. And stepping in is the veteran shortstop, Xander Bogart. Not shortstop. Xander Bogart. Out in front of it, strike one. And that's in there as well. 0 oh 2 now. Man, this guy's really pitched well so far, attacking the strike zone, and he's really kept these hitters off balance. And he struck him out. The tenth victim set down on strikes thus far. Rafael Devers, the next to bat. It was a base hit last time up. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Even though we're late into this ball game. This guy's velo is still top notch. This guy's a horse. 0 oh, 2. Oh, 1 pitch, and he can't make contact on the bender. 0 oh, 2. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. He makes the throw to first. Two down. Next, here is J.D. Martinez. Two outs already on the K this inning, so he'll be looking to do better. Swing and a miss. Oh, Took something off that one, and it's strike one. What a performance so far. Throwing first pitch strikes to 90% oh, of the batters. It's hard to get any better than that. Count now a ball and a strike. Fouled off. Boy, he's been great in this one, and he's only one strike away from putting another zero on the scoreboard. And 
he got another one here. He strikes out the side. He set down five in a row via the punch out and the inning is over. Ready to begin the eighth and standing in is the power hitting second baseman Ozzy Albies. Adam Adovino has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number zero, Adam Adovino. First pitch on the way. Now the 0 1. Strike two swinging just out in front of the slider. Can't get him to chase. It's one and two. It's one and two. And the eighth will start with a bang as this should be extra bases. And the Braves have something going right away. It's a leadoff double. Stepping in now, Freddie Freeman. Freddie. Chopped weakly to the left. He could really use a knock here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. That's taken. Now it's 0 and 2. Arroyo's got it. Throw on to first. In time, one away. Stepping in once again is Austin Riley. His head to head numbers against Adam Ottavino. Not a big sample size, 0 for 1. That's the heavy sinker right there. He has the ability to get ground balls when he needs them, potential double play situations, or to get that jam job with no one on base, that tapper right back to the pitcher. One of the toughest pitches to hit in the game. Trying to get him to chase the cutter there, a ball and two strikes. Albies takes his lead at third with one away. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. So now to the plate, Jorge Soler. He grounded out last time up. Behind on that one, now behind in the count, 0 and 1. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0 and 2. I know that feeling. Played 14 years in the big leagues and still can't hit a slider. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Dubin is there and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. So now here is Bobby Dahlbeck. He went down on strikes in his last at bat. Yeah, and he didn't put up much of a fight either, Matty. Got to find a way. Can't go down three pitches. I don't care if you're staring at him or swinging at him. You have to find a way to make this pitcher work a little bit harder. And now he'll foul this one off as well to fall behind here. No balls and two strikes. And he'll try and one tempt ball, him with one in the dirt, strikes. but he'll hold back here. It's one and two. To two balls and two strikes now. I know he missed with a fastball right there, but this guy's arsenal. You can't figure out what he's trying to do. He's got a lot of different directions he could go in right here. Got him. As he just continues to mow down these hitters. 13 strikeouts now. Just gets a piece of it. Strike one. Check swing here as he couldn't help himself, and it's ruled strike two. Tries the slider to ring him up, but he lays off one and two. Hey, that's a nice take by the batter right there, but that's a non-competitive off-speed pitch. Got to do better to at least entice a swing. And indeed, the throw will finish him off as they get the put out at first, and there are two away now. Next to dig in, Christian Vasquez trying to avoid becoming the third strikeout victim of the inning here. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Center fielder giving chase. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Stepping in for the Braves, Adam Duvall. He's working on a one for three thus far. Ninth Four, inning begins as the first pitch is taken for ball one. 
He looks at a sinker there that drops in one and one. Here it comes. And that's taken for a cold strike two. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Into the box, Travis Darno is head to head numbers against Adam Ottavino. Just a couple of matchups, no hits in two at bats. Swing and a miss. That one tied him up. One out, nobody on. Tries to change up on him there, but it's a ball, two and one. You know he's probably cheating on that inside pitch after he got jammed earlier. If you're on the mound right now, you want to try to hit that outside corner, and there's a pretty good chance you'll get him to roll over somewhere. And the slider gets him swinging, two gone. Next will be the designated hitter, Orlando Arcia, will attempt to put the ball in play for a change here with the first two guys going down on strikes to start the inning. Strike one to start the at bat. Comes set with the 0 and 1. Skied into straightaway right. Verdugo gets there for the catch, and that ends the inning. Stepping up is Christian Arroyo. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. Second baseman, Christian Arroyo. Swing and a line drive. But right there to glove it is the shortstop for the first out. Next up, Kike okay. Hernandez. He Number struck out five. swinging in his last trip Kike. to the plate. Hernandez. Here's the first pitch. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Duvall is there and folks are starting to head for the exits now. Two gone here in the ninth. Now it'll be now Kyle Schwarber who comes to the plate as the last oh, chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. Runs up and gets this one down. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. Two out, nobody on. Check swing here as he oh, couldn't help himself, and it's ruled strike two. Last strike now for the Red Sox. A ball and two strikes now. Well, tried to throw a high fastball right by him there. Didn't work, but now we'll see if that sets up some different options. Wouldn't be surprised to see a good slider down and away right here. They haven't played perfectly as it's hit on the ground. Albee scoops it up. Throw to first. He'll be in time to get him. And the Braves get a complete game shutout from their starter as this ball game is over. And tonight's ends as a 3-0 shutout win. The Braves took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Max Freed is the winning pitcher of record. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show. The victorious Atlanta Braves. Three runs on Ted Hicks. No error. Check. A1, I ain't talking steak sauce. Run this now when I'm a great boss. Run this it ain't for the weight loss. Matter of fact, I'm trying to be the cake boss. Fill up the bag. To the